the first time I participated in the Solar Challenge was in 2014 and our car that participated then was Sirius. It was a catamaran configuration. Obviously we have done a great deal more in terms of um, the shape of the car and we have progressed. I think one of the technologies we've developed in-house was our data logging and telemetry system. We've researched and found a, a lot better components than back then. Uh, because we understand the difference between a cheaper or a less efficient uh, component compared to the, the top components that's out there. So we have gone from the six square meters back in 2014 to the four square meters of today. And we have the tilt wing and what we have come to fondly call the butterfly configuration. I think that is crucial, especially a message for starting teams. You, you cannot buy a, a super top performing car from scratch. The budget is not just there and it won't make sense. So you identify your crucial components that you can reutilize. Um, get them in the first run and as you improve and, and get to know your components, you know what additional components you can buy to complement what you have and that you can reuse in the future. We try to innovate in terms of the shape and in terms of aerodynamics and uh, construction methods. We have another unique a feature in our car in that our wing is aluminium. So we have done aluminium ribs with sheeting for cooling of the panels. That is a bit different that we are experimenting with. We are trying to do a three wheel configuration in the future and that will also push the, the shape of Naledi in the future for the Cecil Solar Challenge.